Okay, so I figured it out. I have cracked the code. I have figured out how old SpongeBob is. And the answer is, it's a trick question. Blam! Ha! -ha. For the longest time, I was like, how old, is, how old is SpongeBob? Because you watch the movie, for instance, and he says, you know, one thing, and then you watch the show, and it completely something else, and there's just this mass confusion. And so, how old is he? So then people online say, well, this is how old he is, or this is how old he is, but then you watch the SpongeBob movie, and it's not the same thing that they're saying. It doesn't add up. So the answer is very simple. It's a trick question. See, there's this dissonance between the real life, what, 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 what we are doing in our, in our world here, and the show time. Okay, so what that means is, let's say, for instance, the show says today. Well, that's not necessarily today, our time. Ha, 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 I figured it out, see? So, like, for instance, um, th this comes across in two different ways. First off is driver's license. The year that it is for them might not be the same year that it is for us. But then, also, here, here's just a little thing. Just because... Um, the show is shown, shown us to be in the modern day it doesn't mean that it is today. It could be in the future, in the past. We don't really know. Okay, so now here's the thing. His age itself is never really clarified. So any theory is going to be obviously have its own little quirks and things to work out. But okay, now follow me on this, okay? On the SpongeBob movie, he says that, that he has 374 consecutive Employee of the Month awards. Now consecutive means that there is no break in them. Okay, so month after month okay there's 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 no gaps now we know that there are some times when he excuse me when he um might not have gotten the um the employee of the month uh, award like for instance excuse me the time that he thinks he's going to get get fired or whatever and so he he goes off probably didn't get the employee of the month award that one because he didn't even work there for some span of time undefined and you know then there's uh then there's uh the times where he he like messed up or whatever or the times that the crusty crab got destroyed or changed into a hotel or whatever and so we don't really know what of that in includes so if you add all that up that adds to over 31 years consecutive of working in the crusty crab which means that it was somewhere over 31 years okay so roll with me on this now we have to add and to add that time to when did he move out of his parents house uh when did he get his job so you can actually get a job before you're 19. you can get a job when you're in your teens if your parents sign off on it well in different states so that brings this whole to another issue are the rules the same in the in bikini bottom and do things age the same in bikini bottom oh okay all right because remember well, that's a discussion for another day. I mean, we're talking about an underwater place where they can still get water, and there's, like, that whole thing that's just confusing, like how you can even have a fire or a grill under the water. I don't know, whatever. Obviously, I know that SpongeBob isn't real. I know that, and you know. And, and, and. But... If it was real, I figured it out, okay? Now, then that brings us to, the, to a really big question. Are all the episodes authoritative? In other words, did all the episodes really happen? I, I know. I know they didn't, didn't really happen. I, I know that. But I mean, in the show's mythology, <laughs> did they really happen? Or um, are some of them, like, for instance, uh, the, the one with the whole fantasy or random land, this was called, the one, the one with random land, did that actually happen? And if so, did it mess with their time? And then also that brings us to the second SpongeBob movie where they do the whole time travel thing. Did that affect anything? These are the important questions, okay? So, assuming that SpongeBob is older than 10 years, maybe closer to 20 years old when he first gets his job, maybe, we don't really know there, but maybe, we're looking at somewhere around the age of 50 or more years old that spongebob is spongebob is somewhere around uh, 50 or more in the spongebob movie there's 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 the the tricky part so in the show he could be in his teens he could be in his 20s and his 30s whatever and uh, so there's that okay um uh but then also there's there's the question of are all the episodes in order I think I actually wrote that down somewhere. 
No, I didn't. Maybe I didn't. I don't know. Anyways, we're serving. So are they? Are they in order? This is this is important stuff, okay? Um, so he's 50 years old in Spongebob's current movie. Uh, uh, anyways, and so the episodes aren't necessarily in chronological order. So th there's there's the issue. How old is Spongebob Squarepants is a trick question. He's a different age in different episodes. And maybe not all of the episodes are chronological. Are, uh, canon so ha beat that